what's up guys in this video we're gonna be talking about the ruler and guides update the new filmora version has just brought out this video is gonna be a bit technical so watch till the end before we get started make sure you have the version of your filmora updated to 13.3 or above I have the version of Filmora to 13.3.8 so I have access to this feature. Now let's get started. Here I'm going to choose any stock video that I want. I like this one. Oops. I like this one so I'm just going to go with this. Now we're going to get the ruler and guides uh, options from. You're just going to click on this and then right click on the video. So once you've done that, you're just going to go on ruler and you're going to get two rulers. One is the vertical ruler and one is the horizontal one. If you see what I've done just now, I've created a guide for you. And if I don't want this, I'm going to delete it. Now here you're going to see a vertical ruler and a horizontal ruler. Now these help us to make guides for our videos. Now how do they work? You simply just click on the ruler and then click and hold and you can choose wherever you want to place this guide on I'm just gonna place this here so this is a vertical guide now to create a horizontal guide you're just gonna go to the upper ruler and then click and hold from there and then choose to wherever you want to stop and there's an infinite amount of guides you can make here oops yeah so this is my guide and I've created some sort of grid to help me place things symmetrically if that helps you now if you there are two ways to make guides one's the way that I've shown you and the others a bit more technical so what you're gonna wanna do is go to the guides and click on add guide now the color is of the guide that I've shown you how to make just now and I'm just gonna keep it as a default now I want to create a vertical guide and this is a position this position is referring to the starting position here and the end position being here so if I keep this to 300 it's gonna be somewhere around here yeah so as I predicted the guide is over here the guide has been formed over here and this is the way how you can make a guide using the add guide feature then you're gonna have to place it around 600 or 750 and then put this over here so by doing that you can even make horizontal guides I just click on the horizontal and then select in the position being the zero position here and the end position being here yeah so this forms a guide in the middle and that's how you can make a guide whoops and this is another way to create a grid using guides now it's not necessary that we can only create grids using guides we can create many other things but one of the most fundamental uses of this is to create a guide now what you can do is lock these guides so that when you click on this you only mess with the video and not with the guides as you can see they are locked and we cannot mess with them and if you don't want to see these grids you can just click on hide guides sorry guides and if you want to see these guides you can just click on show guides or unlock guides by the way these guides will not be shown at the end of your video when you export it you're not gonna see these guides these are just to help you throughout the process of your video editing which is very helpful in my opinion for example if you wanna use this you can a popular way to use this is to create some text I'm gonna shorten this and I'm gonna place this here so this grid helps you to order your elements in a video in a very systematic way and how you can take advantage of this is by in this example you can just 
drag it to all four corners I think for an example sake showing you these two corners how they're placed would be fine and if you want to add subtitles you can just choose this as your reference point and choose the subtitle here so this feature is very useful it's not easy but it's not hard as well so have fun with this feature and if you like this video consider liking and subscribing and i'll see you in the next one